The collapse of the Champlain Condo's South Tower is having ripple effects on condo owners all across South Florida. But nowhere is that more true than just a block away. Residents of the condo's North Tower now asking, is their building safe to stay in? Seven Nicole Insolata takes us inside of that building. I'm, I get very, very emotional of it. Noam Lusky lost friends in the South Tower of the Champlain Condominium Complex, part of which now lay in ruins. Lusky serves as president of the Champlain Tower North. It's identical to the South Tower, but completed a year later in 1982. I mean, everybody says that this is a twin building of the other one, and that if something happens to that one, it might happen to this one too, but it's... It's nothing further from the truth. In a walk through the North Tower's garage shows no signs of cracking, no exposed rebar, no water, and the pump designed to pump water from the garage is brand new. Waterproofing on the pool deck has been overhauled. Fixtures on the roof sealed to repel moisture and balcony tiles replaced in each unit to keep them from holding water. It hides underneath the tile and then it can go into the rebar through the as the cement deteriorates. The association's confidence in the North Tower echoed by an expert hired by the city to help determine why the South Tower collapsed. Structural engineer Alan Kilsheimer says he took a good look at the North and the newer East Towers, and he says there's no need to sound the alarm. Based on the exposed and visible conditions of what I saw, based on my experience with buildings and garages, no, I do not think that's necessary. As long as they do a thorough inspection, they bring in their engineers this week and next week and check everything out and make sure that that everything is really safe and solid, then I'm not worried. I'll stay there because I believe our building is a nice building. It has been maintained very properly. The expert who walked through the South Tower's sister buildings offering this reassurance. I always say to people, if, if, if I tell you I won't let my kids in the building, then you have to worry. I would let my kids be in those buildings. Now, the mayor of Surfside tells us that there was an in-depth inspection planned this week for those remaining buildings. We're still waiting to hear from condo officials to get a status check on those inspections. Reporting in Surfside, Nicole Linsalata for Today in Florida.